Hello everyone, anyone, and welcome back to Divinity Original Sin Enhanced Edition. I am Zial. I am supposed to wait longer to find out uh, people are interested in me going one way or the other, but I am just bloody impatient, so I am going to uh, start this fight, but maybe I won't go too, too far into places. Um, what can I say? I'm eager to play the game, eager to find out some more things going on, so I'm hitting it up early. That plus all this late night recording is absolutely killer. Are they going to start talking again? Because I think I'm going to miss talking last time. Hmm. A little closer. Can you be certain that this is the proper location? The spirits told me they did. I'm sure of it, madam. And which spirits have you consulted exactly well? Uh, the, the, the same as always, madam. The old mother above. Then how exactly is it possible that our party has been searching for an hour, yet there's nearly a single star stone in our possession? I... I can't say for certain, madam. Hmm. Interesting. Now, if I quick check the talent... Oh, that's not what I meant to do. <laughs> Oops. Uh, immune to charm. Anyway, I pressed C because I was used to pressing character for another game. Yeah. Do my um, that makes me happy. Um, I'm gonna slow her down. I'm assuming you're gonna have some reinforcements. So yeah, there's some guys, there's a guy over there. But until that happens, let's see what we got here. Let's get some more points for the following turns. And let's give everybody some luck. Good old getting that crit chance up. Because right now I'm feeling pretty, pretty lucky. Uh, there is always going and her willpower is going to be pretty high. So I imagine it's going to be difficult to hit her with um, uh, crawling infestation. I wonder if I should try though. Yeah, why not? Let's try it. Let's try it, see if this works on boss-type creatures. Yeah, it failed. Oh well. Oh look, inside the bushes. I didn't see that. Ah, out of the woodwork they come. They just nail the heck out of that guy. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. Yeah, go for the guy with the biggest armor. Go nuts. They did a good job of uh, hiding the severity of this threat. Um, part of me is kind of happy it went down the way that it did. Okay, so. Let's look at our situation here. Uh, that caused literally all my points because my G-Master is bad. I probably should just take care of that one of these days. Because I do like that spell. There is blessing everybody. I could encourage everyone and I can knock down somebody. So I think that's what I'm going to go for. Orc Shaman, see you later. Pop on my hit me spell. And let's encourage everyone to do their best. Including the guy who's on fire and knocked down. Yes! <laughs> what? What the heck was that? That was a lot of that was a lot of extra stuff to do here. We might all be in range for this. No, we're not. But I think I'm going to go for... Let's just go for the yield CC to start uh, start off our festivities. We don't really want to... This, this guy in the woods. Why is he invalid? I can see him. He's right here. There we go. And beyond that, I can save points, I suppose. Well, let's uh, put our good old oath damage onto Zial, and then we'll save our points, hopefully through some chain lightning. Okay, so we have ourselves bad guys here. We have the big bad guy, and we also have all of our lovely arrows we can do. Put it in there. Although, now that I think about it, I need to make sure this stunning arrow goes in there just for sake of ease in the future. Uh, let's see. What do I want to hit him with? Some of the arrows that are the best, I only have small quantities of. 
I can hit him with, uh, there's always a good old freezing arrow. Freezing arrow does the trick. Except for when it does it, it makes me sad. So, let us look around a bit. Technically, I can't hit him on the ground. So, we'll just spring some arrows across their bows, if you will. Good. Okay. So, we're in front of her at the moment. Uh, there's always summoning good old Nick, but I do that every time. A uh, little bit of crowd control. There we go. And then after that, let's walk in the shadows. So hopefully they'll play with uh, Seamus instead. Oh, wow. He, so you took a couple points of Scoundrel too, didn't you? Okay. So, a couple ways to go about business. This guy, he's still charmed. Let's uh, push on through. We knocked that one down. Nice. Okay. Then, let's go. Struck by Divine Light. Chances for warm status. Eh, I don't know. Um, bum, 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 Taunt doesn't do anything. This probably won't work on her. But we're going to give it a shot anyway. Yeah. Well, give it a shot. You need to strive harder mm -hmm. against me. Yeah. Can oh, I couldn't have bought the whole party. That would have been nice. What do you got? Well, okay. Well, he crippled him. Stab him. Okay, so we have our options again. I think I want to go with good old Chain Lightning. Yeah. I don't think I got a chance to cast it before, is my reason, or if I did, I kind of forgot. So let's give it a shot. <laughs> There you go. That felt good, didn't it? Yeah. Trying out different things, different times. Uh, ooh, she is in a nasty position. Uh, oops, wrong button. We can do... Yeah, it's, I don't know, it just... Uh, so hitting them... So hitting it's going to be for this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try a barrage again. I really want to see if I can make this worthwhile. So let's see how much that up to. So it's 44, 38, and 34. It's around the same what it's going to be with an attack, but maybe a little bit more. So it's kind of like AP relevant, I suppose. Alrighty. And let's start with the backstabbing goodness. Alright. Wow, for Kill the Nightbringer is not bringing the, the pain, shall we say. And I forgot to freaking put on Bless or that thing. I think I might have made up my mind about Seamus and just giving him more Geomancer so that he can uh, cast Bless so I can permanently have it on Zial. Sometimes laziness is the ultimate uh, motivator. He is no longer... He's not this. She's also there, but she's stunned for a few turns. Okay, cripple failed. Shucks. <laughs> Hit me with this. Jahan might take a blast to the face, but he's used to that. He gets around. I think it was you who came off of the... Okay. Made me feel good. And beyond that, we'll slow him down so he doesn't get as many points. Alright. Moving forward. And of course, the music is dead. The day the music died. Whoa. Yeah. Let's try it. Do it, do it, do better than last time, okay? Because you severely disappointed me last time. Many marks with a marvelous marksman. Oh, it's cool how it's cool how the action works. You know, there's that. Okay, she is totally screwed. Your grave opens to welcome you. Ooh, shiny copper amulet. Okay, so and uh, you haven't bled enough. And I keep forgetting to put on the stance. Just, just put it on. Missing it after. <laughs> because it's getting old, uh, forgetting that. Yeah, run around a little bit. That helped. Ooh, we popped the big healing pot. Ow. Jerk. 
Oh, you froze Jahan. No. Okay. Okay. You're bringing it. You're bringing it. It has been brought Okay. So, we got a couple things to do here. There is making sure Jahan doesn't go down with a healing spell, which I think I will opt to do. Having multiple healers is helpful for that reason. Uh, get in their way a little bit more. Bear daughter, you gotta take down some of these guys who are close to dead. Like him, he's close to dead. So, we'll pop on this other one. Which was a mistake, because I probably should have done the multiple arrow shot thing, but I want to make sure this one dies. 87% chance is really not the best. Oh, failure. Oh, but he died to the bleeding. Huzzah. Bleeding for success and profit. Let's see what we got. There is the weakening shot. There's also just this good old damage, the spell. Coming to a theater near you. And we could freak him out with that. And let's weaken him otherwise. Okay. Oh, there we are. Healing spells. No. Dude. Yep, bouncing around. <clears throat> See, if Jahan even uh, is CC for one turn, you see the CC uh, definitely starts falling off. Try again. Yeah, try that again. I'm fading fast. Ah, you're fine, Jahan, okay? I'm just a queen. Um, okay, so. Do I have anything in the way of CCC? Unfortunately, this isn't... See, this is one of the reasons why G Monster has got to go up. Although I think that, I'm not sure if that's actually going to matter unless I get more of that. Blah, blah, blah. Anyway, let's get busy. I need this guy who's enraged to die as quickly as possible. For the seven. Oh, it failed. Darn. Oh well. Okay, Jahan, you have things you should do. One, I'm thinking if I get close enough to here, I can make sure that at least most of us get the benefits of this this spell. So let's do that. Oops. <laughs> uh, maybe I need to maybe I need to be awake for the entire day before I'm able to successfully do that without it being a problem. So we're gonna scratch that, and I don't think. How's he out of sight? He's right freaking there. Yeah, well, let's consider out of sight. Um, we have a chance to kill him. Chance to kill him. We could just move forward closer to that. So let's move a little closer. Still on the same one. And we're gonna go with the shocking. Okay, he's stunned. Beyond that, does anyone else need to get relieved of anything? I don't think so. Uh, and this is why you buy healing, or you make sure you keep mixing healing potions. I think I'm out of mediums, aren't I? So I'd be busting a large if I did. So we'll just pop a minor oh. be okay. Alright, bear daughter. I think this is the way to go. It just hit him. Hopefully get a crit. Try for a crit. Dang. Really? Wow. Oh. Okay. Yeah, why don't you walk in shadows for a minute so you don't get nailed by anything too nasty. Alright, so y'all stuff heroes are made out of. You don't have any cool spells left, so you need to go behind them and you need to stab them. Yeah, let's do it. 90% chance. Oh, the miss! See? That's the thing. That's why I really want to get the Bless Operational, because that is killer. I mean, relatively. Jameis is one tough son of a gun, though, isn't he? Look at him. Ow. Oh, the crippling effect is killer. Hmm. Honestly, pop a healing pot. Very little actions. Might as well. 
Yeah, look at that. Keep hitting on him. I love it when you do it. All right, so this is back up again, which is fantastic, because I think we're going to enslave this guy here. He's far enough away. That'll help. And stand there. Looking pretty. Um, this ought to get a double kill. Double kill. Nice. I'm powerless to protect myself. We're not. Oh shoot. My bad. That happened because of what now? How did he get stunned? Hmm. Whatever. Uh. Do 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 do. Nah. We're fine. Sometimes I'm like, oh, I'm gonna do this complicated maneuver. It's like I don't really need to do this complicated maneuver. I just need to kill this thing. I can hit him with this. It's all well. Clearing cut. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Darn it! <laughs> I accepted, accepted the stun. Yeah, I'm having one of those days. Eh, whatever. It's got to roll with the punches sometimes. Oh, cool. Thanks. I'll just swallow them. I like you, Charm, buddy. Okay, just kill something and make it dead. She can finish this off. This guy is just out of my reach. This doesn't happen have far farther reach, does it? It does not. Okay, so we shall move a couple of steps forward. And then we shall stun this son of a gun. Blitzbolt! Blitzbolt! Okay, we're good. Bear daughter! You'll get right up in the bear daughter. Hmm. Would have thought I would have had more chances to murderize things from here. Hmm. She'll die. Does he all is still messed up? In fact, that was really a mistake because I needed to unstun my comrades. So that was stupid of me last turn. I'm making a lot of dumb mistakes, but I don't know, it's got my homework at this point. So I'll live with it. Yeah, that spell sucks. So drink a pot. Be happy that you're uh, still on the living. I needed that. Ow. They focus far as y'all in the trouble. See the white light. So, see the white lights, y'all. Nice. Cool. That worked out really well. All right, y'all is no longer in trouble. But we'll give her a heal. And Seamus is coming out of his stun in another turn. That's fine. I don't want to deal with him. So back to taking names and kissing ass. Wait, what? One of those, right? Gosh, it sounds so silly, but part of me just wants to come up here. Switch stances, of course. And let's just go strip him, because he's annoying. Sweep the leg. Oh, wow. All right, you failed me. For the last time, not really, you'll fail me again. <laughs> I'm like kidding here. And stabby stabs. Am I cool stabs up? Not really. Stabby stab. And they turn around when you screw that up, which is an extra. It's just as insult to injury, doesn't it? Okay. Miss. Take another shot. He can't even kill himself on a mini. <laughs> I need to miss Jahan. I like how like Jahan like takes one like straight to his face, yet he is missed. In a, in a sense, seventy four percent chance. Yippee! Man, this guy just is like the stoutest orc that has ever orked his orky orc orcs. So face the unending darkness. Yeah, you all know about that unending darkness. But you don't. Well, it's unending. And it's, it's, it's bad. Do, 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 do. Bring them closer to us. Perhaps me, babe, backstab. Close enough. Don't hit my own guy. 
And Jahan might get shot in the face. I think I might have been doing the words to the uh, Chicago Bears fight song. Or not the words, but the timing of it. Ah, uh, good choice, Swimmy. He is flanked. Yeah, I have, I have to admit, these guys are starting to get some better armor. And I'm starting to feel the effects of some of my weapons being slightly dated. You start to feel that after a while, what can I say? 90%. I'm still taking it. These are good odds to do a lot of damage. Mm hmm. Yep. Alright. Yeah, hit him again. Okay. She needed that. Alright. Uh, so this doesn't. I just shock him with this. No, don't shock him. Shocking is bad. Because <laughs> I'm going to shock my entire party yet again. Uh, so... He won't get a turn. Freezing touch. Really? Really? Just shoot him. There we go. <laughs> Excellent! Exactly as I planned. Shoot this fool. Ba -ba -ba, no music. Just get up close and stop. Into the fray once more. Look at all that leech healing. Isn't beautiful? Whoa, that was a hit. Well done, team. Group hug. Um, so yeah. Anyway, fighting in that here battle was interesting. Pro definitely wasn't my uh, best battle, I'll tell you that much. But, you know, they can't all be perfect. Can't have all those flawless ones. You can't even have all of them be good. I don't know. Um, sometimes... Time, hey, my hey, a stitch in time. Well, you don't say. Let's see what her orders were. Being the least likely to disappoint me, your contingency has earned you a crucial mission. Retrieve the bloodstones of Lucilla Forest. Rumors suggest that you focus your search on the hidden cave of the fool named Martino before laying waste to the village of heathen goblins to the north. Destroy their idol and seize the bloodstone within. When you are finished with them, turn your attention to Silverglen. Spare not a single weakling in your search. Loik, the abbot of the Immaculate Temple, would surely rather part of his bloodstone than his head. Relieve him of both. Remember, I prefer bloody sums to empty hands. Gratilda, the avatar, the Allmother. Okay. Because her name wasn't Gratilda. Her name was... Grankulda. Grankulda. Uh, yeah, that's right. I made the, I, I decided, command decision, bam, be a better Geomancer. Because I want to be able to bless if I any freaking problems. Did I help this out at all? Nah, he needs more intelligence. But this only costs five now. I did it. I made a command decision. I'm not, I still haven't figured out the talent though. That, we'll have to wait for another uh, episode or me figuring it out. So, repairing the equipment. This is something that happens, uh, more often than you would think, like the necessity of being able to uh, take care of this. Um, I forget, like, all the time, seriously, <sighs> to do it. So, all right. Uh, Fortune. Fortune. Oh, more orders, huh? Okay. I, Gruntilda, hereby declare these papers are carried by members of my tribe or humans who have sworn allegiance to me. You shall let them pass or suffer the full wrath of ever sizzling ire. All right, praise to Amon Hor. Of course. Of course. Okay, cool. For a second, it looked like it wasn't, like, highlighted. All right. The, uh, beat stick of comparable status-ish. Not really. Unlock skill. Earth absorption shield. Reflects 10%. Now, that is not a terrible item for, uh... Our Geomancer, in terms of Seamus. He's already got his nice little uh, uh, weapon he has, though. So, not super necessary, but it's decent. I don't know. Maybe if I feel like it. Uh, beyond that, he's got the biggest strength, so he's become the, the carrying guy. Trying to save the rest of the carrying stuff for when Zial decides to open up uh, like objects using um, luck and... All that sort of good junk. Warm as dragon's breath. Yeah, I love that. 
they are always warm as dragon's breath. I just, uh, sometimes I think, um, you know, just things for Divinity uh, Original Sin 2. Because, you know, I, could do with I surely drink. am getting enough views that they're going to think I'm absolutely necessary to talk to when it comes to making any of their decision-making process. But <laughs> some of the things I'd like to see uh, be slightly improved is, um, can we not have them have to do that every time they see a fire? Like, for realsies? It gets a little, little bit, little bit, little bit old. Um, okay, so now we have this going on here. There's obviously a vent there. There is a curious parchment. This looks like a job for Zial and Seamus to do separately. So Zial is going to get closer to see if we get any traps in the immediate vicinity. Doesn't seem like it, right? Alright. See, the obvious thing to do is to pick up this here box and put it over this vent, right? But it feels like I should not do it with that the one that's closest because the one that's closest might be a problem all right let's read this curious parchment you have Mardino is watching you and he hates the grimy fingerprints of strangers sign Mardino the middle all right cool good for him I'm glad you're all malevolently uh yeah there we go that's it that's all you got it's weak your sauce is weak man uh, and a level one chest, so why not? We'll get closer, do the whole survivor's karma thing. Whoop do frickin' do! And Zial will go and open that up. Look out. Oh, shit. Okay, now we see what's going on. This is what I like to call one of those actual justifiable moments when hitting, um, the uh, disarm trap is nice just because you know it's going to blow up here, and if you explode it otherwise, it's just going to cause problems. Look out. I see a trap nearby. Sweet. I don't know if I got anything cool there, but let's see what we got here. Claymore. Alrighty. And some armor. Okay. Nothing to write home about, if, unless I have Medora was still hanging out. And I do miss Medora. I won't lie to you. Every now and then, I think back on her lovely way of speaking her complete paranoia for cats and animals the fact that she didn't trust Arhu because Arhu's a Careful. I've spotted a trap oh you know one we already walked over oh there's another one over here that's weird it's almost like the trap didn't work properly hmm, okay anyway uh maybe it's because I did things right and they weren't actually connected who can say um, I guess I will say I think the trap didn't work properly because they expect you to move the closest crate to it uh, to cover up that. Anyway, point is, is that Mardino's little empty, well, I missed that. Oh, pick up an augmenter, yeah. Hell yeah. Um, okay, so beyond that, as you guys can see, this is heading into Goblin Town, which is one of the places that we can go. So it's either that or heading out to Hyberheim. I'm still going to uh, wait for comments to see which way you guys want to head first. I think that both have their merits. Um, I think one of those merits is I'm trying to remember if I've ever actually completed the entirety of uh, uh, the other area here. Huh. So that's everything, huh? And this was... no. Uh, if I remember correctly, that was where these guys were there. All right, so without stepping too far into Goblin Town, let's just try to see if we can get a nice little sneak attack on that singular guy using all of our roguey goodness. Uh, beyond that, we'll kind of let it go. A lot of things they were talking about, I believe, was the idols. And if you can manipulate them, perhaps you can trick the goblins into doing something. I don't know. I'm warm as fresh apple pie. He's warm as fresh apple pie. He's just letting you know. Someone seems to be enjoying the afternoon sun. I'll bet we can slip ah! while his back is turned. Darn it. It's better to avoid a conflict now than to have to face a goblin from here to the mine. Well, that was a great thought. Until I just walked everyone up and he turned around the way he did. So, never mind. I could reload and do it like that, but I don't think that would be necessary. This guy's a surprisingly uh, beef armor. It's one thing that's definitely checked on. 
Oop, it's too far away, so never mind. Just shoot him. Okay. Uh, yeah, we can't have him escaping. Sweet. Bring him closer. Do what you will. Ooh, look at him. On the mend. That is interesting. Did I have an ability that reveals stealth targets? I kind of forget. I wish I could just like, can I just control click and just trip the air around there? Interesting. Hmm. Okay. So we have ourselves the first time we've actually encountered somebody going stealth. I don't know if I ever remember an enemy going stealth like freaking ever. So we're in delay turn. Now, Seamus, if I recall correctly, I think this ought to reveal him. Let's try it. Divine, Divine light. light. Well, he's over there, because it said warm. That's about all I can say at the moment. Uh, I could just magically go like this and just go, ha ha! <laughs> now that is how you are be, end up being a cheap a-hole, like I am. All right, let's go up and uh, stab him in his uh, goblin swashbuckle. He, he drank a potion. You're not even skilled. Hell, Jahan can do that. Everyone can do that. You have to drink a potion. All right, backstab crits it is. Uh, while this guy is down, I have the option to attack twice, so we'll do it. And yeah, anyway, first century will be down. Uh, good opportunity to, if everyone has enough sneak, you can sneak on by that guy. Although, for an entire party to be that sneaky would be uh, pretty crazy. It'd be, it'd be pretty awesome too, don't get me wrong, but it'd be pretty crazy for everyone to have the ability to um, sneak that hard um, because it's pure damage um, uh, you'd have to make sure the entire party had enough ranks in it and you'd have to time out all your stuff and bloody bloody blah and he's going to die this turn or next turn anyway oh he's up Seamus cares not Avatar Fighter Scrolls and some of this. Now, we could heal Zial or she can just take a lovely blood bath. That is, how can I help you, my friend? Yep, that's great. All right, anyway, so we'll get the healing going on here. So anyway, I am noticing that I feel like these guys have got a fair amount of armor going on. Now granted, it's probably just getting later in the game. And like I've been I stating, I feel that a lot of my weapons might be a slight bit dated in terms of melee characters. They just have a lot of armor, maybe decreasing armor abilities or other ways to go is what we should be doing so anyway um hyberheim or continuing down the goblin road goblin road and then we'll just higher is that a song um so anyway thank you very much for joining me in this episode of video original sin number 70 yep 70 videos of 30 plus minutes sometimes 40 uh, 35 on average maybe um videos have been recorded on this game alone i think uh I don't know, what's your guys' bets? I'm thinking I'm just going to make it to like 120 before the game is finished. Um, especially if I diddy-dally the way that I am doing right now. Dilly-dally? Not diddy-dally. Diddy-dally is what you should not do. That sounds really terrible, actually. Alright, never mind I said that. This was awkward. Thank you very much for watching. Please leave a like. It helps out immensely if you enjoyed the video, that is. And I will catch you in the next one to be recorded later. Hopefully people will let me know uh, their preference. Alright, have a good one. I'll catch you in the next episode. Cheers.